Old style step dancing features footwork that is danced close to the floor and usually in a small amount of space with a still but relaxed upper body. This is a solo performance art and it often includes a spontaneous or playful stage presence and the steps are danced to fast traditional tempos. We'll be looking at this style of dance in detail today, but along with the steps, we'll also hear Kevin and Aiden in their own words, sharing their dance stories, knowledge, and memories. seen the movie George M. Cohan with James Cagney and I was just so taken by that movie that I went running out into the kitchen after that movie and said to my mom that I wanted to dance like that. And the jigs and hornpipes that I've seen you perform and that we've performed together. Where did you learn those steps? Those steps was a combination of Steve Connie's uh, steps, Mary Sullivan, and also um, later on I started taking from Miss McCory in Pawtucket, Rhode Island, and she had a style of the old style dance as well. <laughs> teaches people let them by watching what I do right. and by the sounds right. by the sound the sound of the rhythm and by, by visually right yeah and the visual aspect is is very hard because when we say close to the floor or low to the ground your feet barely come off the ground yeah. I remember kind of coming in very close <laughs> trying to get down right there by your ankles what is he doing um, <laughs> I think I got the hang of some of it anyway yeah. The more secret steps I have, I keep very close yeah. to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> so the music and dancing were always went together in Clare. That's why the music in Clare is unique in style, it's rhythmic. Uh, if you hear the Kilfenor Tully, Tully Kelly bands, it's basically good dance music. You know?